Hi, welcome to Desi Plaza TV. Name me Madhav. So we do have great people who have defined physics in their own language with n number of devotees. Now today I do have uh, Prince Nallamodala who is a third grader with me. So Atan Gurinchi yanta chepna takwe because he has a day on his name. So ENT Avani anedi e deep ka discussion jays tu vatli guri chanta tilts kun So Prince, how are you? Hello, Nar. I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you, Prince. So Prince, first of all, Koncho, can you just tell us about yourself, your family? Yeah. Um, I'm eight years old. Um, and I'm nine years old. I'm in third grade. Um, I, my birthday is on January 18th. Um, my family and me and my mom, we like to do science a lot. And my dad, he is kind of like a technology person. So it's kind of like I learn a lot from my family because they provide me with lots of information and they give, give me lots of knowledge to learn from. So that's how I got interested into science from my parents. So you are a third grader, right? Yes. So when, when was the first time that you actually remember when you did your uh, interest towards the science experiments and all this stuff? Um, my first science experiment I did, I was about six years old. Okay. So now I'm nine. So. And what was that first experiment? Um, I made a spectroscope and what it does is it can tell the different elements of the periodic table with the light spectrum and mm -hmm. you use the different light patterns as different elements so I thought maybe if we shine it at different planets we can see what it's made of like helium, hydrogen, oxygen and all those things. So, how, so you do have a prototype over here? At your yes, place? yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll uh, go. Go, go and have a look at it later. But so this first, I mean like your interest towards, uh, how did you actually develop this interest towards science? Um, my mom does a lot of science things. Um, um, she does lots of science. She studies science a lot. So one day I was just curious of what she's doing, and I saw, and I just, it, it's really, it just became really interesting to me. So since then, I've just been learning more and more. So your mom is your teacher. For, I, yeah. And, and and your da dad is a uh, one who supplies you yeah, with yes, all your yeah. stuffs, what you want. Mm. Good. So. And uh, so that that was the it was six years old yeah. uh, and that was your first experiment and then what was uh, after that what all uh, things did you invent? Um, I've done multiple things such as for paradigm challenge I did the sneeze pod and then for the Chicago toying game fair I did a happy family app board game and video game. And then uh, last year, Explorer Vision, I did, um, I did safe. No problem, you can take a help. But when, how do, I mean like, uh, before and uh, before a challenge comes, I mean like, for example, the first experiment, it was, there, there was nothing planned for it, right? Mm -hmm. But this afterwards, then when you entered into the Chicago, uh, what you say the competition yeah. and all those comp so how did you actually end up uh, selecting that particular uh, uh, thing for example a sneeze pods yeah so uh, did you how did uh, how how did you do your homework it was you along with your mom, mom and dad or how did you end up um, uh, selecting that particular challenge yeah so the the concept or idea how I came up is, is um, I just study a lot and then I sometimes I just come across problems around the world and I just try to solve those problems and make the world a better place. So it's all out of box thinking. Yeah. Good, good, good man. And uh, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a scientist or an inventor. A scientist or an inventor. You're already a scientist or mm. an inventor, right? Yeah. So you want to just continue this? Yeah. No, 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 no change, right? In in, in your plans. No. Good. And how does it feel uh, when people actually you you already have a day on your name, yeah. right? So how does it feel when they say on on March fifteenth, it's it's Prince Nalamotala Day. So how does it feel for you? Um, it's uh, I feel very thankful and grateful for Mayor Jeff Cheney for giving me the a special day all to myself uh -huh. and I feel very grateful for that. Grateful. Good man.
So, and uh, I, I, I definitely never knew that I'm going to complete my college, where I'm going to complete my college, okay? But you, you got an entire scholarship for your four yeah. years degree from UNT, UNT right? UNT, yes. So, I'm, I'm sure you're not going to definitely, yeah. you, you'll, you'll be having other options, options when you grow yeah. up. But how does it feel when uh, someone actually gave you that offer? Um, again, I felt very grateful that um, he just came and gave it this big opportunity to me. Mm -hmm. It feel very grateful and thankful that he is giving me such a big opportunity. And what do you do in your past time? First of all, let me know, do you have some free time or you're all yeah, always... Uh, I have lots of free time that I do for different activities. I play soccer. Um, and I do, I finished black belt in martial arts and now I do kickboxing mm -hmm. and I like, I have lots of other activities as well. So, and how do you, how do you manage, man? You, <laughs> you invent things and which, which school do you actually go? I go to Cali Elementary. Cali Elementary School. So, and uh, do they, how do, how do your school guys support you? Is it like... Uh, um, they give lots of encouragement and they show lots of grace to me and they show lots of grit and they're just very kind to me and they're just saying like, keep on going, you're doing a great job so far, keep on going and they give me lots of encouragement. And, and so you have a timetable for in, uh, for example, yeah. say 8 o'clock, you wake yeah. up at 8, 8 to 9 sharp, yeah. you have to do this. So what I do is um, on weekdays, uh, I will do at least one or two hours of uh, science work, where, uh, whereas on weekends, I will do at least half a day okay. of science. And, and, and the other activities, how do you manage? Um, <laughs> like I am... Um, no, I'm just arguing, that's fine. Because of me being uh, at this age, I, I can't uh, do whatever you have done. And at this age, you have achieved everything. That's a good thing. And one more thing, this YouTube channel. Okay, yeah. To start a YouTube channel, whose idea was it? Um, it was my idea because after I did so many challenges, I just wanted to spread all the knowledge with the world. And I want there to be more people like me. So the world can become a better place. That's a good thought, buddy. But you have around 528. Five, yeah. Uh, I also do not have those many subscribers. Mm. No? That's the reason I actually agreed uh, for the <laughs> interview, you know, because so that I, at least people would know <laughs> who I am. <laughs> but that's a good thought. So it was your thought and yeah. how do you, where do you, I mean, like, it is like all you actually sh uh, have those videos prepared at your home or? Um, I write the scripts, but my mom with the camera, she will record everything. And then we will use, we, for the editing of the video, we will use KineMaster and then we will just. So everything, technology is uh, your dad, everything yes, is over, yes. over here in home. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's a good thing. Mm. 528 subscribers, not a yeah. small thing. And about generally youtube videos we know people uh, these days yeah. they're, they're making every crap thing in youtube yeah. but quantum physics right that's what you you chose yeah. so your why particular quantum physics um as i said my mom studies lots of science and one of the things she studies is quantum physics uh -huh. which is the study of subatomic particles and so I, I i was just thinking of like how does everything work is it all due to quantum physics? I mean, like um, everything atoms is due to quantum physics or atoms are part of quantum physics, right? And everything's made up of atoms. So I wanted to know how everything works or how things work in a certain way or when they're being observed, not being observed. So I just got really interested. I had lots of questions. So um, I just wanted to learn more. And then again, I just wanted to share all my knowledge. I, I wanted to ask you one thing, but I know it will be a stupid question for you. But when you uh, try to learn something, so how do you try to understand it? Is it like the moment you, you study something, you go, you experiment it with the uh, things? Or is it, uh, how do you try to understand it? You go to your mom or dad, ask uh, ask them to explain you? or No, this is actually for uh, the other guys yeah. so that they can follow the same and try to grasp, grasp the more. So my mom in quantum physics, she teaches me in simple terms of, of different things like uh, if quantum physics it uses the atoms or something she will try to explain it using people or marbles or toys or something like that so then I understand the concept and then I try to explain that in the easiest way possible in my YouTube channel 
So oh, okay, so first you uh, she explains yes. you, you understand it, and then you pass on to yeah. the other people. So it's like after this interview, people can actually approach your mm. mom for uh, yeah. what you say for tuitions and all those stuff, right? Yeah. <laughs> Probably good. So then it is like uh, you already won what you say the the Nobel Prize for kids, right? Yeah. And so your next target would be for the Nobel Prize for adults, right? Uh, so no. what? Uh, yeah. Good. Um, what I'm aiming for is the. PIA award or something. Uh -huh. It's the environmental youth um, environmental youth protection awards. Okay. So that's the. It's a actually like you meet the president. So uh -huh. it's like a national thing, and it it's really. I just want to get that one. Uh, I um, that's so what that's I'm the, aiming for. So to all the all your competitors, uh, it's a it's a it'll be a challenge, right? Asking yeah. them. So I'm good. I'm going to be in that line. So be careful. Mm. <laughs> but that's fine. That's a good. I never. I mean, like I I don't know what what that is, so I can't comment on it. What what's 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 there? In, uh, that's that's one thing. Uh, so is it like you have a special? Uh, are you preparing something for that uh, particular uh, competition, or do you have something in your mind, or you have to uh, still think about uh, what you're going to plan for? So before I enter into a challenge, I brainstorm my ideas and I just pick which which idea is the best at the end. So then I will work on that idea. I'll try to make mm -hmm. a working prototype. Then I'll put. I'll just uh, submit it into the challenge, and that's how I get through. Get through it. So we'll take a quick break over here. Yeah. Go see your experiments, yeah. all your stuff. Mm -hmm. So just stay tuned. Uh, we'll we'll just go uh, to Prince Nalumotla's experiment. Just see what all uh, he has for us, and we'll try to demonstrate. And uh, he'll he'll try to demonstrate for us, and let us know.